Scared money don't make no money, man. You speak on what you know, respectfully. Let's keep rocking. There's no fail over here. Big spender, I stand on business, pay the bag, don't need no witness. Grind. Hey, what is going on, y'all? How y'all doing today, man? This is Salon Boy Brick, aka Brick the Lyricist, and you all tuned in to GAN with another old NASA's Gaming's Music video reaction. Oh my gosh, bro. I think the legends are all coming out, man. They they doing their thing right now. First we had Exhibit. They, uh, and somebody already dropped it and said that uh, Exhibit is actually coming out with another one. So I definitely got to look that one up too. You already know. But now we got Ice Cube. And then I just saw one that um that had uh, uh, um, uh, Snoop Dogg on it. I don't know what's going on, you know what I'm saying? But I'm happy that the old school artists are coming back out. They showing these young bucks how real hip hop is supposed to be done. So I ain't gonna waste no time, man. We're gonna hop right into it. So Ice Cube just dropped a new track. This shit already sit here's the crazy part. Seven day he's the first old hand that I know that's been doing this shit. Like Snoop Dogg is more famous a little bit than more than Ice Cube is. Like Snoop Dogg is in every fucking thing. This nigga got his this nigga is in in, in, in Call of Duty. Is he is he in is he in uh Fortnite? I don't think he in Fortnite, but he he all over the place. This motherfucker cooks with Martha Stewart. <laughs> Yo, he has his own gaming channel. Like, what the fuck is going on? Snoop Dogg is out there, but the drop the album the track that he just dropped doesn't even have close to what Ice Cube just dropped. Three point one million in only seven days. What the fuck is going on in the world? This shit gotta be a banger. So I ain't even gonna waste no time. We're gonna hop right into it. We're gonna do what we do. Then we're gonna come back and we're gonna rate it. As always, I'm gonna hit y'all with the overall, which is the music, the vocals, the the hooks, the uh the beat, the hooks, the uh the lyrics, and the video. And then I'm gonna hit y'all with those four different categories, which is flow, word plays and metaphor, multiples, punchlines and delivery. You know what I'm saying? Those four different categories, I'm telling you, as an artist, if you have those four different categories, you are winning. I'm going to give you three artists that I know that have that, that always be hitting me real, that, that always get me real, uh, get me real hype on every track. Wheezy, Lil Wayne, Joyner Lucas. <sighs> no, that's a hit or miss with him. Who's another person? I was going to say Dax, but I don't think Dax... Dax sometimes is a hit or miss with him, so... I ain't going to... But those two right there, I'm going to give you all those two. Because somebody... It was somebody else before. I can't remember who it was that was really getting me hype. And they always hit me... They always get me perfect every time. You know what I'm saying? They always get me right when I listen to them. But those two right there. Eminem uh, 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 and Dax. Oh, oh, M. 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 M is another one. Maybe not the old... not Maybe not the new M. Damn, dog. Now I really got to think about that, though. But Wheezy and, and Jordan Lucas are the main two that always be rocking out, man. They always do their thing. They always hit me right. Always perfect with their music. You know what I'm saying? We got to do that. When you hear that hit me right shit, I ain't talking no ditty shit. So please do not take this out of context at all. I'm talking about as far as the music. I'm always hyped when it comes to the music. I love the music. I keep on rocking. We do this shit. You already know. We ain't going to waste no time. It's called My Ego, Ice Cube. Let's rock. Let's do our thing. And then we're going to come back and then we're going to ready to get Salon Boy. I always get the West Coast. I hear it already. Let's see. Where the love go? It's a struggle. Is this happiness? Nigga, fuck no. But I'm slapping this in your mouth, though. With a heave ho, you a deep throat. West Coast, bitch, is the dosage. I can't overdose on no whole shit. I'm uh -huh. minister this pimp shit. I've been a minister since an infant. I was Kendrick before Kendrick. Rock and roll Hall of Famer like Jimi Hendrix. So you Talk can vomit on that bullshit. You know. Or you can choke on your own spit. When your boy's in the pulpit, try to rob my church. I'm going to rob you first. I'm going to do the funeral and drive your hearse. Oh. I'm going to hug your mama before I steal her purse. I'm going to hunt your bitch because I'm the curse. I see Check what my I verse <laughs> in reverse. He's spazzing out. Go get the nurse. She Yo. passing out. From this ass to mouth, crazy. of ass to mouth, I'm cashing now, bitch. They know it's my ego. All you hoes, you know, you know how it it's my ego. Please, old heads don't die. Keep trying. 
popping. This is cuz and happiness. So tell Al Green to pass the grits. I bag a bitch, I got a bag of tricks. Looks like you got hit with a bag of dicks. This right here is oh the master mix God. of Bloods and Crips, so don't resist. I'll smack your ass like Will did Chris. Give a demonstration in front of the nation. Smack. I ain't playing. If I had to leave your motherfucking ass right where you land. Smack. Leave me alone. You might live longer if you mind your own. Watch your tone. I'm too damn grown for this shit. Sticks and stones, well, I'm a pick to stick. And crack your ass, you need a maxi pad. To stop that blood coming out to gash, punk. Hey, no. It's my ego. say drop the attitude but y'all shouldn't worry about what daddy do y'all should worry about what kids do i'm a cold motherfucker get out my igloo In the, the ceo person. with an ego can pick any flow any mighty mo and body you bitches make y'all religious i'm here to fight reptiles and lizards yo motherfucker new Friday, the grand gotta be out. take that shit wipe my ass then i flip it i break that shit like when your cousins come visit and then i tell them fuck your analytics I don't pivot, I give it to you vivid If you's a bigot, you probably won't dig it If you's a hoe, you probably get triggered Like one of these internet bitches Oh, hey no new school shit bro old school is where it's at can't nobody tell me shit the lyrics the three verses the video if you don't tell me you were engaged in this shit oh my god bro it's not like you just standing in front of anything and just walking by looking pressed and you showing your niggas and their guns and all. like there's really a storyline behind the words it... being a music artist means that you're able to, I keep saying this all the time. I think I said it in exhibit one too. It means that you're able to paint a picture using your lyrics, using the music. Even before I seen this video, I should be able to imagine what the fuck is being said. I should be able to vividly picturize it in my head as I'm listening to the music, whether it relates to me or relates to the people around me or relates to my neighborhood or relates to the suburb. It should, I should be able to see it. But then when you get a video behind it that is just so entertaining, that is just so gangster, that is just so docile, that is just so funny, that is just so everything that hip hop should be. This is what hip hop is, man. It's a culture, it's a lifestyle, it's something that we love. It's not about who got the best, like, fucking cars and the hoes and you showing ass and all this other shit. Like, everything that you see in the new school, you saw it in this video. But did it make you feel aggressive? Did it make you feel like you wanted to go crazy and you wanted to go ham and you wanna be savage now? No. It made you feel like, yo, this is the type of music I should be dropping. This is the type of shit I should be listening to. This is the type of vibes that I want when I'm listening to my lyrics and my homies. 100%. I'm not going to give it no rating. We talking straight four out of four for the overall. Straight 40 out of 40 for the... <laughs> yo, everything was right in there, yo. Everything was right. The punchlines, the way he flow, the, 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 um... 
the the metaphors that he was coming up with. Like it's just so it was just like so simple lyrics, but it was just so refreshing to hear hip hop has not died. So fucking refreshing. Yo, y'all gotta jump in the comments. Y'all gotta let me know what y'all think, man. Y'all gotta let me know what y'all think. Because this shit to me was fucking fire. This is to me was fire. You tell me what you think. I think overall it was fire though. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even gonna lie. But y'all tell me, man. Yo. This is Salon Boy Break, aka Break the Limits. This is Onassis Gaming. As always, do not forget to dream big, play hard, live good, stay blessed, stay humble, stay focused, keep rocking, keep doing your thing. You already know I appreciate you guys, and I love y'all for being here. Just remember, put them in, put, listen, if y'all don't ever comment any other time, if y'all see this video right now, and y'all been watching all the way to this end right now, all right? Jump in the comments, and just put hip hop is still alive, all right? Put hip hop is still alive. That's it. That's all I want you to do. Just jump in the comments. You don't never comment any other time, but comment down and say hip hop is still alive. That's it. To let me know that you watched this video all the way to the end and you appreciated the shit out of this motherfucker. There's a reason why that shit got two, uh, 3.1 mil in only seven days. That shit should have had way fucking more. Look at Exhibit. Oh my God, bro. And even Game came out. Even Game came out with a track. Snoop Dogg, are we going old school today? Listen, the, the October month, the, the October month has been fire, yo. I, uh, Libras are winning. October month has been fucking fire. I think Scorpio time is now, but Scorpios and Libras are winning. Like this shit is crazy, man. Just keep on, just listen. Stay blessed, stay humble, stay focused. I love you guys. I appreciate y'all for watching this all the way to the end. Can't wait to see y'all again, man. Let me know what y'all think about this reaction because I was fucking excited about it and I was I was excited for a good fucking reason. I mean, you already know, man. Peace. I love you guys.